I can't remember when I didn't love dancing. Uh, even before I took lessons, I was told that when there was music, I would get up and move around. And whether I defined that as dancing or my parents or friends defined that as dancing, it was just always a joy. All of the nonverbal arts, whether music or dance or visual arts, are making tangible, are articulating things we can't put into words, which otherwise is very nebulous and since it can't be put into words, uh, we wouldn't be communicating about it if we couldn't put it into movement. I think that dancing is important to humanity. I think it must be important to humanity because it exists everywhere in the world. I think of dance as a global phenomenon with culturally specific uh, characteristics, and I just mean by that that people dance in a way that reflects um, their cultural environment. To me, modern dance is a genre term, but it describes what happens in dance after the impact of modernism, whether it's a choreographer who says, I'm not particularly interested in working out of a previously set vocabulary of movement, whether it's jazz or ballet or tap. To me, that is the essence of modernism. You're going from an idea to the appropriate mode of representing that idea. This particular piece, I, uh, I draw on the students to bring their own ideas to, create their own variations of work that I have given. Uh, to react to whatever the idea in a particular part of the dance is. So the, it's very collaborative. We're working off an idea that concerns how people respond to a catastrophe or disaster. And the abstract images, the collage of images that uh, suggest grief, anger, but also then culminate in uh, the kind of resilience, support for each other, uh, individual and collective resolve not to be beaten down by whatever this is. Ever since 9-11, I have thought more about how people respond to things that seem to be so disastrous, and how you uh, hear first about all the terrible things in general, and then more and more you hear about the heroism, more and more you hear about the selflessness. So uh, it's not a narrative dance. As I said, it's a collage of images for people to look at and respond to with their own associations.